Welcome back to Rocker's Beer Review and it's time for another review. We're still waiting for summer to come back. The weather has generally been terrible. I've got my Van Halen shirt on. I thought that might inspire a little bit of, uh, you know, a bit few summer nights, you know, summer nights on my radio. You know, does this feel like summer or what? It doesn't. But anyway, today we're going to be trying this from Pressure Drop. It's uh, a brewery that I have not tried before, but I've seen um, seen them online a few times, and I decided to buy a couple of those uh, on this latest um, on the July haul. Uh, this one says that it tastes like summer, so maybe we'll get some inspiration. We'll get some, we'll drink this. The sun will come out, and we can enjoy more beers in the garden. Okay, so what is this? So this is called Golden State. It's a New England Pale coming in at five point two percent ABV. Um, let's see what the sort of hops it's got amarillo uh bbc uh and amarillo syro i'm not quite sure what the difference between those are crack open a cold one sit back and enjoy we're bringing citrus to the show so i think it's very citrusy orangey um but let's get it into a glass and see what it looks like shall we so pressure drop i think they're based in north london Tottenham Hale, don't hold that against them. Um, there we go, look at that. We've got a one and a half, just under two finger, very fluffy, uh, soapy-like head. Um, very yellow, pale and hazy, uh, just like a good beer should be. Um, let's get some aroma, shall we? Yeah, very citrusy, oranges, lemons, Quite subtle though, you know, it's, it's got a fruity sort of smell, but it's not like some of those sort of big sort of juice bomb type of uh, tropical smells. I'm getting orange, lemons and limes, uh, and they're quite subtle. Anyway, let's uh, let's get down, shall we? Cheers, everyone. It's quite unusual, that. Very fresh. Very citrusy, zingy, lovely and refreshing. It's a shame it isn't a hot day because I think it would taste much better if it was a hot day. Um, you're getting those sort of citrusy flavours, but you get also get a little bit of sweetness in there. So the sort of orange flavours is almost like a sort of marmalade. Um, you've got a very slight, slight, subtle hint of grapefruit. Yeah, a little bit of grapefruit, a little bit of orange peel, giving that a little bit of sharpness. Quite dry, but really nice in a, in a you know a dry in a nice way. Get those flavours there. It's fair, you know, medium carbonation and sort of medium to 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 light on the um, in terms of the the the, the um, volume and the balance of the of the beer. Um, I wouldn't say it was overly soft on, on the palate. Yeah, I'm starting to get more and more of the grapefruits, more of that sharpness, that sort of real tanginess. As I say, more like the orangey, marmalade sort of orange peel, maybe even blood orange, pink grapefruits. That's the sort of flavours. Very nice and refreshing. Very sort of fruity. Yeah, nice drink. Um, still don't get massives of aroma, but, you know, if you want a summer crisp, drink this is a good one to have so let's get the scores in shall we okay scores are in for this uh lovely little um drink that tastes like summer pressure drops golden state firstly aroma not Massives of masses of big, big aromas. It's quite subtle. You get very citrusy sort of oranges and lemons and limes and that sort of thing. Sl slight bit of grapefruit. So in terms of aroma, we're giving it 12 out of 20. Um, appearance, well, I think it looks beautiful. I mean, it's lovely, yellow, hazy, nice little soft, fluffy head. Uh, so we're giving it a 9 out of 10 for appearance. That's pretty good. Uh, Flavour. It's nice and crisp. Very dry. I mean, it's, it says it's a taste of summer. I can imagine this is the sort of drink you want to drink. Outside, barbecue, you know, it would go down a treat. Flavour-wise, 33 out of 40. 
value for money. Uh, four and a half quid for this, you know, it's a nice beer. It's got a lot going on, eight out of 10. Uh, and overall experience, well, I'm really enjoying this. It's certainly a drink I think I could drink quite a few of. It's quite light, light quite crisp. Um, it's obviously coming in at 5.2%. So, you know, reasonable sort of level of strength, but nothing overpowers a fairly sessionable. Uh, I'm giving this a 14 out of 20, and that is for uh, my overall experience. So that gives us a total of 76 out of 100. It's another white snake of a beer. So what are we going to do with this white snake beer? Slide it in. Slow and easy. You'll notice there was no slip of the tongue with this with that one. Okay, so that's it. Pressure drop. We've got another pressure drop in the fridge, so we'll be coming soon. But until the next review, keep on rocking.